Hey yeah, so we're going to go through a new feature highlight that's been highly requested and that's multi-region support. By that we mean when players come to your Unreal Engine experience in the browser, they will get a server that is span up in their local region, meaning they get the lowest latency possible and the best experience possible. To do that, I'm going to use an example on our Make Live website. I'm going to use the art gallery. So if I go down here, you can see my art gallery project. You'll also note that we've got project build status and we've got three ticks, one for each region. This just denotes that when we do a build uh, and once you've uploaded your project, we distribute that build across each region, which ensures that when servers spin up in that region, they, they have the fastest possible startup time. So let's go into the art gallery project and you'll notice there's a new section called regional server matchmaking. If you're an existing user, you'll note it's set to Europe like I've got here and it'll have the relevant GPU that you configured. What you can do is send traffic to a single region. So the new options here we've got are America, Asia, and I'll come on to the all option in a moment. But what this allows you to do is select a single region to route all of your traffic to if you wish. If you know all your traffic is going to be in America and you want to use a T4 GPU, no problem. Just set that and away you go. But if you truly want multi-region support and not have to think about it, you can click the All button and you'll notice you get GPU options for each region. Of course, we're working hard to try and get GPUs that are consistent across every region, but until that point, we give you the flexibility so that you can configure and select which GPUs you wish to use. So what I'm going to do is I've selected all. I'm going to use a 1080 Ti in Europe, in America a T4, and in Asia a T4. And then all I have to do is click update. And that's it. When users come from each of those regions, they will get a server span up in that region. To show you this, if I go to my VPN, I'm currently connected to United States. Uh, I'm actually based in Europe, but I'm connected via my VPN to United States. So if I go to a new session in a browser and I'm coming to the art gallery and I click launch, I can then click play and then what we can do is we can switch back to the server live view and you'll note that our art gallery is now provisioning in America. On top of that I'm just going to show you that in the art gallery settings you can also configure the always on instances across region as well. So if I toggle that on you'll note that I get the same options to be able to configure the GPUs across each region for my always on instances. And then what I can do is set one instance in every single region and I'll hit update. If we head to the server view, what you should now find is it will spin up your always on instances, one in each region with the GPUs that you configured. And it's that simple. Configure your regions, configure your GPUs, and you've got full multi-region support for your Unreal Engine applications. Thanks for listening.